Good morning! It is around 11 a.m. We just made the two hour and 15 minute drive to Sandbanks Provincial Park. We parked the car. They see the lake already. We haven't taken everything out of the car, but we're first gonna go down to the water and like see if there's a good spot. Plop some stuff down and then get the rest of the stuff from the car. We honestly found the perfect little spot to enjoy our day in. They don't call it Dunes Beach for nothing. It's got this beautiful powdered sand, the lake, and that's our little spot right in there. There's my mom. So when we read about this beach yesterday, online they had recommended not to come between 11 and 3. We came at 11 on the dot. <laughs> So I was a little bit worried. Essentially what happens is if it's too busy inside the park, they don't let you into the parking because they, especially now, obviously want to make sure that there's not a ton of people here because we're still trying to social distance and be safe. So I'm very happy that we found such a secluded little spot, our little secret spot right behind me. It's also really nice because our space has this little picnic table, which will be great for lunchtime. We've got a beautiful view of the lake that we can enjoy from the blanket. I will mostly be splitting my time between this blanket and that lake. It doesn't not even feel like we're in Ontario. Our little secret spot is right through there. I'm just really excited to be here. I've been wanting to swim in some sort of body of water for so long because it's been so hot out here. So we're a little bit more settled in now. I thought I would do a little what's in my beach bag. This is my beach bag today which is also just my tote bag that I use pretty much every day. So this obviously doesn't include food or towels or anything like that because we have other bags for those things. This is just what I want to keep more or less close to me and more or less in like within a reaching distance. First things first, have to protect your skin in the sun. I've already put my body sunscreen on, but I like to have my face sunscreen close to me. So this is the CeraVe Facial Moisturizing Lotion with 30 SPF. We'll be reapplying this all day. My Mario Budescu because it's hot and it just feels nice. Do you want some? You want to take your glasses off? <laughs> Feel refreshed? I do. It's lavender scented. Mm. What else do we have in here? Facial lotion, just to keep hydrated, and some brow gel for when my brows get all wacky from the water. Hand sanitizer, very, very important. And in the same vein, got some masks, because you never know. We're living in un unprecedented times, people. Sunscreen, I have the 30 in my bag. We also have a 60 with us. Sunglasses case with my headphones, because I will definitely be listening to podcasts and music all day. I've got this little head band thing for when I'm swimming. Honestly, even for right now, because whew, I've got a lot of hair and it's very hot under here. I also have my big hat. Actually, I'm gonna put it on because it's getting a little sunny. Now we're really in the beach spirit. My camera case, because I'm obviously vlogging and I've got an extra battery in here as well. Ooh, very important, portable charger. Although I do have to say the battery on the new iPhone is quite good and I also keep my brightness quite low. <laughs> so the battery should last me all day, but I brought this just in case cable to connect the phone to the to the thing, you know. Tic Tacs, minty fresh breath. Got my phone, I just put this fun new pink case on. Very summery. What else, what else, what else? Ooh, I have this little uh, portable sunscreen and it looks almost like a deodorant stick and you pretty much just like apply it like this. Rub it in, very convenient. I always have this in my bag, especially during the summer for reapplying. Ooh, oh my God. <laughs> What was that? Cards to entertain ourselves. We'll probably be playing these at some point, maybe over lunch. My mini tripod. You are currently on my big tripod. The book I'm currently reading, which is Americana. It's taken me a really long time to get through this. Not because it's not good. It's actually a fantastic book. I'm just a really slow reader and get easily distracted. And typically when I read, it makes me very sleepy. So if you have any tips about how not to fall asleep while you're trying to read, Please let me know. Great book, highly recommend. I'm about halfway through it, 10 out of 10. I don't know what else to say. I need to finish it though. Wide tooth comb, probably won't be brushing my hair, but you never know. And that's it. So we're gonna put all this stuff back now. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, everything. 
everything just spilled out of that little, out of this guy. Now it's covered in sand. That's it for now. I've decided it's time to attempt to blow up the floaty. I've never done this on my own before. It's gonna take every bit of lung power I have. This is the starting condition. And we're gonna get it to look like this. Our own little oasis float. So wish me luck. I'll keep you posted on my progress. So I just tried to put on my lip glow and uh, just half of it came off on my lips. So this is going into the cooler. I feel like it's not a beach day if that doesn't happen to you, you know? Now if that does happen to you and you have too much on your lips or your fingers, you can also double as a little cheek stain. You gotta make do with what you've got. I've also passed along the blowing up floaty duty to someone else I've delegated it okay I've left the boys to blow up the floaty <laughs> and my mom and I are just coming to explore the dunes it's already so much quieter oh the sand is very hot <laughs> this is what it looks like wow that's so nice there's my mom over there in the distance <laughs> I think we're gonna climb this big dune really cloudy over there as you can see but over there it's like fully <laughs> blue skies <laughs> Face. Climbing the dune because I want to see what's beyond. So we're gonna discover that together. This is also um, very good exercise going uphill in the sand. <gasps> wow, look at this. My floaty is almost complete except for these. These are still a little sad, but we'll get to them. Lunch time. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Have some homemade wraps here, courtesy of my mom. Had some lunch. It's gotten a little bit cloudy now, but it is pretty blue skies behind us. So I'm hoping in the next few minutes, the sun will come out and then I will go for my first swim. Go on the private island, let's swim. You wanna go on the private island? You mean this private island? I'm waiting for the perfect moment. When it's sunny. Now it's too cloudy, it might be cold. We've decided we're not gonna wait for it to get sunny because we don't know when that will be and we need to use the island. Here we go, little piece of California in Canada. Ready or not, here I come. Under the umbrella, waiting it out. We've moved all of our stuff under this beach umbrella, which has come particularly in handy. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> My dad's currently trying to will the weight, the rain away. Will the rain away? That's a hard, that's a tongue twister. Will the rain away? Will the rain away? It is no joke. Look at the water. It is really coming down. We survived. The rain stopped. How does everybody feel? Oh. <laughs> Wait, did I speak too soon? But the sun's out. The sun is out. No, I think it's gone. I think it's super. About to go take advantage of the sunshine. Life at Sandbanks has resumed after the storm. This is what the dunes look like now. It's cool to see the like before and after. Moms come with the bubbles. I guess I should go with the wind. Let's go this way. <laughs> I suck at this. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh oh. Did you feel more rain? No, no, no. no. no I felt feel a couple, that? yeah. Well, where is it coming from? It won't be the same as before, though, right? Okay, let's keep climbing, but quickly. Little guy, he's so cute. 
cute. Look at him go. He's heading up the dune to the lake. What I'm amazed at is how they know where the lake is. with me. We are currently going back to the car because our day at Sand Dunes is done. Sorry, this box is very distracting. It's very sad. We had a lovely time though. We will definitely be back. Mom's back from the bathroom so we're gonna keep walking to the car. I'm trying to do this sign off and avoid the poison ivy behind me. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing a little bit of our Friday little Ontario getaway. I don't know what my hat is doing but hopefully there will be many more beaches this summer. Hoping to explore, discover much more of Ontario and Canada. The first of many lovely little local staycations. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video and I'll see you next week. Bye! Thank you.